Hey dear viewers, Lance Corporal Joe Hartley here, world renowned combat mission expert and guide, bringing you a scenario called Bumps in the Dark 1982, a scenario from the uh, US campaign. Uh, just having a quick look at the map here, we've got two thrusts from uh, Soviet forces, one down the main highway, another one uh, on the uh, American left uh, coming up through uh, some backcountry uh, roads trying to outflank our uh, ambush position. Set up uh, mines, target reference point, two of them in fact, um, so we can ambush uh, or delay the uh, Soviets as long as we can. Not really sure what the elements will run into. The scenario briefing describes a forward security element which is uh, made up of a tank platoon and a BMP uh, mechanized company, which would be quite a handful for uh, these fellas. Uh, the thing we've got going on here is uh, there's a bit of mist, and uh, we're in an ambush position with a um, reverse on the reverse slope of this uh, dip into the into the valley. And you have a uh, platoon scattered uh, squads uh, around the around the place. Got some uh, dragons, of course, and we've got a reinforcing uh, engineer squad, which I've equipped uh, with with uh, dragons uh, as, well, as well. Hopefully, they'll make a mess of the uh, Soviets as they come forward. Got uh, most of them set up, hidden, and uh, armored covered arc just for the moment. And uh, the plan of action is um, as soon as the uh, Soviets trigger these landmines. On the middle of the road, we'll just bring down some artillery uh, exactly the same uh, place and uh, start to cool the uh, Soviets as they come forward. On the left, abandoned essentially the uh, farm farm complex, farm barn here, and just lay down some mines uh, which will cause some casualties. If we have any shells left over from the 82mm uh, mortars, then uh, Put them there and see what hurt we can we can grab. Our fellas uh, are here on the hill. Um, lots of trees in the way. Unfortunately, that's going to interfere with a few of our dragons. But uh, they'll leave it up to the fellas there to uh, choose their targets. Hopefully, we won't hit any trees on the way through. Here we've got some tow equipped uh, M901s. Based off the old M113 chassis, and uh, got some 50 cars in M113s here. Not a lot um, to defend against the uh, tank uh, platoon and the BMPs because these M113s are just uh, ballistic gel, really, rather than armored vehicles. But we'll see. 25 minutes, and uh, like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more of. Uh, or Bat Thunder. Just trying to uh, continue to work out uh, what my thinking would be. Oh, I've got some uh, troops coming. Oops, and some artillery. Artillery. Of course, the Soviets would open up with uh, an artillery barrage. Or down the back here. Not sure. The briefing talks about defending crossroads, but if this is a crossroads. It's not what I expect the crossroads to be. Got some backstop uh, with a uh, dragon team right at the back. Looks like our first um, spots will be here. Quite a barrage. BMPs coming. Interesting. A lot of power down on the back. Not 
not sure what they would get, um, how they would spot that. Not sure they've got um, aerial spotters too. Time for the uh, artillery. Bring your targets. Three tubes, heavy, medium, immediate. Fire mission over. Take four minutes for that. Uh, to come through. Put uh hips. Artillery round that was a RPG or some other painful uh, rush Soviet weapon. These will come through. Oh my god, thank you. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Yes, too much of a low value target. Spotting, reloading. Comes a BMP there. Oh, nice. Oh, the Russians are coming through their own barrage. Thing 
actually coming. Thirteen to get some hammered. Target, target, target. Stop. Come on, back. Stop. Stop. Oh, get your bad anyway. Dragon, no. Hide. Some fellas uh, down, down here. Very target. Three. Medium. Short. Sweat fire. Take, 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 take. Just wait um, until the artillery comes down here. Come on, vehicle. A lot of infantry. A lot of infantry. Request fireman and L. Roger. Fire perfect. Call cool, these guys forward. Just to see if they can uh, spot anything. Oh. on the vehicles. Over. 
that again. Keep doing that. Okay. Ah, oh, that sounds bad. Let's get this guy to come up just a little bit further. I want to see where that tank is. Ah. Oh. Badly for one by thunder. Oh, what part? Oh, Roger. Fire for effect. No missiles. Any missiles? No missiles. tank in the backfield. Oh, it's not gonna do us any good. Ran out of missiles from everyone shooting so early. It's been too much time. Uh, get these guys to get quick. See, he's got a dragon, three dragons. Oh, nice. He moves, he goes fast. Oh. Hide. Hide. He's lost him, yeah. Took it out with a dragon. Good job, fellas. It's only quick come to here, I think. Any 
more artillery left. Ah, oh, just getting hammered now. Just getting hammered from these fellas. These guys can crawl. Let's see him. Exiting foxholes is a recipe for disaster. Have to jump up and run through open ground. Two, two M one thirteens lost. Still got a dragon here. Squad here. We might be able to uh, pick up some targets. The uh, woods uh, behind the M one thirteen is all impassable, so I'm trying to move into it. It's, uh, it's all uh, not allowed, which means this road doesn't give any cover to the M one thirteens. I actually thought about uh, taking them all out of here. It's just such a deadly uh, combination of narrow roads and cover. The M113 is just being made of ballistic gel. What the hell's up to here? But missing the two toes is a disaster. This was. Uh, in a campaign game, you'd be pissed at uh, the old one back thunder. Target, yes, target, 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 hit. Just keep on shooting at it, don't stop until it's in flames. Leader is moving. Does that mean there's a dead, dead gunner? Maybe a vehicle or that. Sides, yes. Do it. Do it. Decal on the sides. Perfect. Just keep shooting at it though, don't stop. Show each other your sides. shot. Oh, penetration. That's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. Okay, quick into these uh, box holes and all. Hope that there's not, not enough, uh, no infantry left. Back. 
Well, we're taking out some of the BMPs for the loss of that T1 M113s. Oh dear, my friend. Got the HQ. What happened to the uh, Dragons you had? Oh no! Of course. Two minutes left. Got to uh, do some hunting now. Let's see what. Uh, oops. Let's see what vehicles are left. Could be uh, pretty bad news actually. There's a tank. I think there's three tanks gone. Killed two, uh, two and four. It's just so tough to get uh, you know the uh, to see what's going on with vehicles that don't have much um, vision. Like the modern uh, Abrams and uh, Strikers and so on, these uh, vehicles just relying on uh, periscopes and so on to get uh, to get uh, line of sight. Infantry, get them crushed. Got uh, RPG, and like that. They're all dead. Oh, army total victory. So I won by thunder total victory there with the Soviet army surrender. Must be very close to the time end of the scenario. But a very costly for the Americans. 25 men uh, US uh, killed or wounded. Which is more than, or well, roughly a third of, uh, a bit more than a third of the uh, total force. Two tanks lost and two armored vehicles lost. The tanks would be the uh, tow vehicles and the armored vehicles, the M113s. But the Soviet army didn't score a point. Didn't capture the ground, it didn't uh, get any of their parameters, didn't get uh, US casualties, ammo, or condition. So a zero from the Soviets. Let's review, review the map. 32 seconds to go in the scenario, we've got a surrender that's coming down to the wire. This tow vehicle, one T64, the artillery observation vehicle, two BMPs and a truck and a T64 tank. Great job, fellas. This one, Comrade Victory is none. This one, three, which we saw the fellas just die. None, none, one casualty. Tank down south, two toes. Yep, if he had a bit more support from BMPs or infantry coming behind, he would have uh, crushed everyone in his path. This fellow, one BMP, good job with the MGs. 42 casualties from the artillery. That's wicked. That's really wicked. That's what uh, hurt them the most. One casualty, one casualty, none, two BMPs and a truck, well, what would they be riding around in a truck? Two BMPs, great, great work, one casualty, one casualty, this fell out three, two M113s, yep, could have guessed it, what's that, a crew, crew, fellas at the back, Eight. 
on BNP. Nice. Star of the show. Got a BNP, yes. Why well, didn't the Soviets uh, claim this as a uh, victory location? It's hard to know. Great work, great work. All these fellas got a bit uh, punished, wounded, casualties, rattled. Wow. Every real one but thunder victory here. That's uh, trucks gone, trucks all good order. BMP gone. BMP, why didn't those, those fellas, if they were organised, could have uh, taken us out? That's really great. Uh, Wombat Thunder victory, total victory and our Soviet surrender. If you're in the campaign, you'd be pissed that uh, two tow vehicles were lost, but uh, so be it. Alright, like, comment and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.